happy Wednesday to each one of you today. I'm trying to black and white video on this rainy, rainy morning. I uh, do want to read a little passage from the Gospel of Matthew. As Jesus was walking along, he saw a man called Matthew sitting at the tax booth, and he said to him, follow me. And he got up and he followed him. And as he sat at dinner in the house, many tax collectors and sinners came and were sitting with him and his disciples. When the Pharisees saw this, they said to his disciples, why does your teacher eat with tax collectors and sinners? But when he heard this, he said, those who are well have no need of a physician, but those who are sick. Go and learn what this means. I desire mercy, not sacrifice. For I have come to call not the righteous, but sinners. Thanks be to God that Jesus came for the broken, for the sinful, for the destitute and the poor, for those that were suffering, those that are lost, those that are drowned out, those in need of help. We have a mighty Savior in our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And I can only imagine the feeling, the connection that Matthew must have had with Jesus when he saw and heard him say, follow me. That sense of freedom and grace must have overwhelmed him. The good news changed his heart and changed his life. This is what we try to do every time we gather. In our prayers, in the administration of Holy Communion, in our gatherings, in our song, and in our dance, we try to give freedom and love to all of us. I know I need it, and I know you do too. This is a way for me to invite you and let you know about a new service at St. Mark's beginning tomorrow at 1130. We'll have a short service of communion with laying on of hands for healing prayers in the sanctuary. Come as you are, bring what you have, and lay it at the foot of the cross. We'll gather together and pray and share in the body and blood of our Lord with each other. Zoom, sadly, is not available for this service. But if you are able to attend, would love to see you tomorrow at 1130. We'll begin to do this once a month. So if you miss tomorrow, don't worry. There'll be a chance in October. I wish you all the best to quote our dear friend John Prine on this rainy Wednesday. May God the Father and God the Son and God the Holy Spirit guide, keep you, and preserve you from now until that day when you rise with our Lord in the land of light and liberty. Amen. Happy Wednesday.